What do you experience when I say the word responsibility? Because in my experience, people feel very differently when they hear the word responsibility. Some wear responsibility like a badge of honor. They take responsibility. They carry it with pride. It's meaningful. It's taking care of something or someone. It's taking ownership of your life. It's making choices and then standing up for what you've chosen. They take responsibility, taking responsibility. That's an act of choice towards responsibility, leaning into it. And then on the other side of the spectrum, it wears heavy on people. You were I've been given the responsibility and now I'm scared and anxious that I might fail, um, that I might not live up to the expectations. Something went wrong and I'm responsible, right? I'm being maybe scapegoated or people are angry at me or maybe I'm angry at myself that it didn't work out. So that's the spectrum. The thing is, responsibility is intricately tied with concepts like ownership, and freedom. And everybody wants to be free. Freedom is such a cherished concept. Um, the whole of America wants to be free, it seems. Um, and freedom is arguably a, a good thing. We like autonomy. Autonomy is one of the pillars of psychological well-being, right? being able to choose freely what we want to do. But the thing is that whenever we choose something and we have a free choice, then it, we, we are responsible. So if things work out well, we're responsible. And that's a good thing. But when things don't work out well, we are responsible. And that's often not considered a good thing. So we like to take the freedom but push the responsibility away when things don't work out. And that's not ownership. If you live ownership, if you want to own your life and the sense of ownership, what a beautiful experience. But we can only experience it once we start making active choices and accept, acknowledge, and embrace the responsibility that comes with it.